Then I think it was the middle of winter. <laughs> With his new Equinox 600, I've got the CTX. That's Vanquish 440. Hey, look at this, look what he's done, look. Too much time on his hands. We go, we go for heat shrink. <laughs> he's wrapped it. Yeah, that's what you can do when you've got too much time on your hands. Twelve forty-four. Sunglasses, put them on then. They're all right for Layla. Yeah. Take them home, give them a good clean up. Hey? Take them home, give them a good clean up. Weather's took a turn for the worse, so wet gear on and we'll head back out again. Buster's stopping cleaning the lifeboat and just me and Pete and his van push. 440, I'm going to get the Equinox because we see taking the batteries flat. Right. Mm -hmm. Never think it was a middle of the summer, would you? Let's crack along. Paul C and Crawford's Metal Detecting. Powered by Mind Lab. Fueled by passion. Subscribe, enjoy, and learn more. Probably a ring pull. of a bullet. Tip of a bullet. Wow. That was a 
29 on the equinox. I don't know what that was. Pinpoint, he pinpointed it. Doopy! Doopy! Woo. Fortunately dated. 1980. Lovely. The weather has took a positive turn for the even worse. <laughs> Absolutely slamming it down. I think we'll head back. The low, low water line there. About about a mile and a half back to... <laughs> Oops! Now what you done? Buster's engineering! Oh no! The walk of shame. And he's back from the walk of shame. Headwind all the way. He's excited about something. He's got a coin. You ship half penny, I bet. Oh, sixpence. Well done. 1953, well chuffed. Very good. Woo! Sixpence. First old fine. <laughs> Days. Best be careful with that one. That's a big one. Complete. I think it's some sort of badge. Let's go. Let's go find a puddle to wash it in. Seventeen. Don't know what it is. Not that like old, is it? You do big puddle. What you get stuck in mud? Yeah. 
still got a pin on it anyway. Oh, maybe went that way. We've got love out on it there, look. But it's not your oldest coin anymore. Uh, that one is Victorian sixpence. It's been a bullet kind of day. We're digging lots of bullets. <laughs> that is a keeper. Jesus, what? Hang on, that's a bit of a puddle. Mother Mary. <laughs> that comes sharp if it hit you. You have a pound of lead there. Twenty-six, twenty-seven. Here another piece of shrapnel. Oh well, no, it's not. Let's not boot that one, either. <sighs> oh dear. It's fizzing. Anti-43. Got a bit of a cuff link. Well, the same as that bit of shrapnel. I don't think it's anything. Nah. Just a bit fancy, isn't it? Got a coin! George V. 1917. 18, 19. I doubt it'll be a bullet. As we're doing it for real. <laughs> Oop, not tap it there. Nineteen forty eight. Live three oh three. Well, what a wet day that was, but uh, Buster, Buster had to give up and go back, but well, Pete carried on, got absolutely wet through with the vanquish. Uh, 4.40, rain cover on, out in the wet, not a problem, and all still works good, but uh, a little bit of exploring, me and Pete on our own, uh, we took the GPS out with us, plotted some locations so we're gonna we're gonna go back and we're gonna give them a go but uh, the old stuff we found the brooch not as if you can see that i'll put a close-up picture on that was the brooch got a love art on it and uh, I, don't, I don't think it's out sparkling uh, the cuff link again nothing precious metal uh, 
the threepence, Elizabeth II, I think is 1960. Just Paul, not to get in there. Right, 1960, threepence. The old one penny, 1917. Um, and then the really good stuff, not the cable ties. But uh, I think a big bullets, usually a 303 is a big is a big bullet. That's still still alive. That's a dangerous end. Find loads of them. Let's find a complete 303. To find two, I have once before found a full clip. There was five five in a clip. Two live 303s in the 1940s, 1942-43. And then the big dangerous end. The size of that baby. That's, that's nearly a, it must be three quarters of a pound in weight of lead that. If you know what that's come from, that's certainly not a rifle bullet. That is one corking thing. And then this bad boy. Look at that. That is an absolute monster. You compare it to a 303. <laughs> Still alive. <laughs> Let's not get caught with that in my pocket. I'll take that to the police station. But yeah, we've got uh, some spots marked in the GPS. Obviously, I'm not going to build built in GPS like the CTX 3030. So we've logged some spots and uh, when we can get back a, a good low tide, we're going to hit them hard. We'll have the CTX out, we'll have the oh, Vanquish 440, Buster with his Equinox 600. If you enjoyed the video, you could subscribe, give it a thumbs up, comment and share. That would be awesome. Wow. <laughs> Are you washed down?